In this lesson, I'm going to show you how to create 30 days worth of social posts using ChatGPT. In this particular instance, we are going to use real estate as an example. Now, if this is important. If you have my ChatGPT for real estate course, there is a feature in here that's going to make this very easy for you. So Ballon Academy, ChatGPT for real estate course. If you have this, go ahead and log in. Once you log in, what you're going to see is you're going to see this inside your lesson material. So you're going to see this exact thing right here where it says ChatGPT for real estate. And you're going to see this uh, scrolling tutorial inside your lesson plan. Now, what I want you to do is come down here and hover over navigate to, and this little guide me option is going to pop up. And this is gold. Click on guide me. It's going to open your chat GPT account. And then you're going to have on the right hand side, this guide me. So now you can go through chat GPT with my tutorial right here on the right hand side, the tutorial I created. So, if you don't have ChatGPT for real estate or the ChatGPT for bloggers course, you can go over to Balan Academy and get it. But let me show you what the prompt does. So I'm going to give you the instruction here. I'm a real estate agent in, and then we're going to put in a location. Specializing in, and then we're going to put in a niche. Give me a 30-day content calendar with the post hashtags. Include my contact information in each post, and we're going to add the contact info. So let's well, here's what you do. Copy this prompt, paste it in here at the bottom. So in my case, I'm a real estate agent in, and I'm going to put in Las Vegas, specializing in, let's say I specialize in luxury homes. Give me a 30 day content calendar with a post and hashtags. Include my contact information in each post. So now you add your contact information. So whatever you want to be in there, I'll put the Ballon Group, and then I'm going to put in 702-604-7739 and I'll put in our website. Okay, something like that. Then you're going to click this little arrow. And as you can see on the right hand side, I gave you the sample prompt and I gave you the sample output. But you can see right here what's happening. So here's your social post for day one. Looking for a breathtaking oasis in the heart of Las Vegas? Check out this stunning luxury home with exquisite features and a beautiful backyard. Contact me for more details. Now, if you're going to run that one, you're going to want to put a link to a luxury property or at least an image and a price or something like that. Day two, explore the epitome of luxury in this magnificent ma mansion. So again, this is a listing. Number three is a listing. Okay. So this is up to you if you want to run it like that. Up here, we could say specializing in, let's put... Um, the Las Vegas real estate market and see what it does. Play with these niches. If it doesn't give you what you want, just play with the way your niche is worded and it will give you an entirely different output. So here's check, check out our latest listings. The second one mentions that we service luxury properties. The third one talks to investors. The fourth one talks to home sellers. And you could go in there and change that URL. If there, It looks like it didn't even put the URL in there. So up here, I could I could say something like include my contact information in the next post. And here I'm going to put um, include the live link. Let's see what it does there. No, I'm not getting the web. All right, let's try include the website. We want to make sure. Let's do include the website. There it is. Okay. So it's not coming out the way the, the prompts are not exact, meaning the output sometimes changes, even if your prompt doesn't. So if you're not getting what you want out of that prompt, just go in and tell ChatGPT exactly what you want it to do. So in these, in this case, you've got 30 days worth of prompt. So you got seven. So if you click this continue generating button, that might give you more prompts and it might work really well like it just did. Sometimes it gets a little squirrely and I'll, I'll change it to continue at day nine or something like that. I'll type in the prompt. 
But anyway, once you get all of these, you can go in and now I'm going to go copy that over to Facebook or I'm going to put it in a social scheduling tool. You can change the URL to go directly to a URL on your website, a landing page that matches whatever it is that you're pitching. That would be ideal. If you're just looking for quick and easy, leave it as is, put the post up there, put your .com up there, at least they've got a link. But if you really want to get good at this, if you're talking to investors, change that link to a page that takes them to properties for investments or whatever item of value it is that goes with that post. That would be a better way of doing it. Anyway, that's it. Have fun with that. I hope you enjoyed it. And uh, check out more over there at balanceacademy.com.